is up, Job Squad? I held that one for a while. It is your boy, Intel. That is me. I am Intel. You guys are the Job Squad. Welcome back. Uh, we're back here with Universe Mode. Battleground has been hot so far. The United States Championship going back to Neville in a surprise of events. The Intercontinental Championship regained or retained by William Regal after a knee to the head knocked Billy Gunn out clean. William Regal then went into a cross face of sorts that Billy Gunn could not get out of because he was knocked the fuck out. Uh, here tonight, we're going to go ahead. We're going to simulate um, two of these matches. We're going to simulate this one and this one because the, these two guys are going to be in this match anyways, so it's not a big deal. Divas Championship, though, Paige wins, and uh, Shawn Michaels preserved, uh, persevered, I don't know why I always say preserved, uh, and defeated Chris Jericho for a huge win. So there you have it, Shawn Michaels beating Chris Jericho, not a big deal. Let's go ahead, let's get into Sheamus versus Mark Henry. Of course, Sheamus was the number one contender after defeating Kane, but now he has to put that on the line against Mark Henry. Uh, and so here we go. We're going to turn entrances off for this one. We'll turn entrances on for the World Heavyweight Championship match. If you guys are looking for that one, just go ahead, skip a little forward, and, uh, and that one will be coming up shortly. Otherwise, watch this match because the number one contender will be decided here in this bout. Two ginormous men. Two hard-hitting big men. Mark Henry. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! Whoa! 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 What is going on here? Both men outside the ring! We're gonna play as Mark Henry. Uh... Boom! Huge right hand! We should've probably went computer with this one. Mark Henry going for a chair! Oh, he missed! Oh no, maybe he didn't- Oh, he's beating the shit out of Sheamus with a chair! Just beating the holy hell out of him! Oh, and there's a huge chair shot to the head. Referee's still out. Mark Henry picking Sheamus up now. Thro throwing him that way. The referee's still out after being, uh, after Mark Henry was shoved into him. A weird turn of events here. But the referee is back up. If Mark Henry can get Sheamus back into the ring, he may be able to get a, a quick victory here, though, although Sheamus likes to have regained consciousness, and uh, he is back in control. Russian leg sweep there onto the outside. And now Sheamus in control. Mark Henry, though, not going to forget those chair shots. A huge left hand there by Mark. Throwing Sheamus into the stairs. They really need to do an animation where the stairs just, uh, you know, fall off the turnbuckle there, but that's okay. Mark Henry inside the ring, standing behind the referee as though he's a scared little boy. Not really, because he's a big man. He's the world's strongest man, knocking Sheamus over. No problem. He beat the holy hell out of Sheamus with the chair there, if you remember correctly. Mark Henry, though, big headbutt. Big time headbutt. All right, here we go. Mark Henry, huge right hand there. The world's strongest man looking to get a number one contendership match, or a number one contendership out of this match. Sheamus, the reversal. Here we go. There's a reversal, though, by Mark Henry. Russian leg sweep inside the ring. Mark Henry in control of this match. It looks like perhaps... Uh-oh. There's a reversal, though, by Sheamus. It looks as though uh, Mark Henry really gained a lot of control by having the referee knock the fuck out by him. Right? Sheamus pushed Mark Henry into the referee. Which is strange because then Mark Henry ended up with the with complete control. Here we go, though. Sheamus going for an early pin here. Mark Henry kicking out before the one count. Sheamus looking a little bit disoriented. Looking like a little bit out of this match. Maybe it was the chair shot to the head. Maybe it was the, the 20 to the body. Maybe one of those other ones clocked him in the dome as well. Sheamus now sending Mark Henry off the ropes. He's a bit of a slow man, so it didn't take him a second. Drops his head down on the knee. Mark Henry gets back up, goes back down. Here we go. Sheamus in control. Uh-oh. He's got him up. Mark Henry reverses, drops him down, inverted DDT. Mark Henry now. Uh-oh, he's out of stamina. Uh-oh, huge arm drag there by uh, by Sheamus. Uh-oh, no reversals left for Mark Henry. This is bad. Both men are out of reversals. Oh, if this was the rumble, Mark Henry would be out, but it's not. It's not a rumble, so he's all right. He's going to be fine. Sheamus uh, looking to regain some stamina here. Uh, to perhaps, perhaps catch a breath. All right, so now Mark Henry 
on the outside. Sheamus on the outside as well. The last time these two guys were on the outside, Mark Henry beat the hell out of Sheamus with a steel chair. Throwing Sheamus into the apron. That is a very hard part of the ring, and Sheamus took it straight to the lung. He's out of breath. He's out there. He's huffing and puffing as he's laying down. Let me, let me, let me tell you. I almost said, let me trust you, but that doesn't make any sense for what I'm going for. Doesn't make any sense. Doesn't make any sense. Mark Henry. Uh-oh. What is his fucking signature? Crawling headbutts. Okay. Bear hug. Seriously? Seriously? So when I was tapping Y, this is no, just okay. No big deal. Sheamus, though, dropping an elbow down on Mark Henry. He's going to go for another pin here. Mark Henry kicking out. No problemo. Sheamus looking a little disgruntled this time. A little angrier. He looks like, oh, he goes for a huge right hand. A huge clubbing blow. No. He's got the cravat. Throws him into a bit of a neck breaker there. Sheamus dropping the knee across the throat of Mark Henry. That's going to that's gonna cause some breathing problems there, let me tell you. That's going to cause some breathing problems. Huge knee to the head. William Regal pulled one of those off on Billy Gunn, winning his match. Oh, and there's a big knee to the, to the chin. Maybe the chest. Mark Henry picking up Sheamus. Oh, he's going to go for it. The world's strongest slam hits it. Sheamus is in trouble. Sheamus may have lost his number one contendership. Here we go. One, two... Three, we have a new number one contender. Mark Henry wins. There you have it. Mark Henry with the victory here tonight at Battleground. He is the new number one contender. Sheamus put his number one contendership on the line here tonight. Mark Henry wins it all. All right, there you go. And now the referee going to raise the number one. Oh, no, Mark Henry not feeling it. Get the fuck out of here. That's right, Mark Henry using the steel chair, although the referee was knocked out, so it, it is very much so legal, right, I guess? I mean, not legal, but, you know, legal. Mark Henry defeated Sheamus in a heated match, though the rivalry isn't over yet, as the animosity between them develops. All right, so I guess they're going to continue going at it. Um, that's cool. Now... We move into the World Heavyweight Championship match, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna set this one up to where the computer is gonna battle the computer. We have we have played every match leading up to this. We have played every match at every pay per view between these two. We're gonna let the computer decide who the better man really is. I guess not really the computer. I guess they're both just gonna battle it out. So let's jump into it. Edge, Booker T, World Heavyweight Championship is on the line, guys. Who comes out victorious? Will Booker T retain? Will Edge regain? We've already seen one regaining here tonight with Neville. Of course, Neville and Edge both lost their titles at Money in the Bank. Uh, Booker T and Bray Wyatt had won. Neville already won his championship back. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, and it is for the World Heavyweight Championship. Neville, of course, already won his championship back. Can Edge do it here? And here he comes, the challenger for the World Heavyweight Championship, the rated R superstar himself, looking a little bit bare without his championship. Here comes the pyro. Here comes the pyro. The pyro of a champion, if you will. And there it is. Edge wants his championship back. You can tell in his face he is taking this very seriously. Him and Booker T have had a heated rivalry over the last couple of months. And it looks to culminate here at Battleground. These two men the last couple of weeks have been going back and forth. Trading victory after victory. Beating the hell out of each other on SmackDown. To decide which of these two men are the better of the two. And which man deserves to be called champion. Now, the current World Heavyweight Champion makes his way to the ring for this heated bout. And there he is. The Big Gold Championship proudly presented around the waist. Booker T. 
the pyro of a champion. Can you dig it, sucker? Champion Booker T. Can you fuck it? And he's going to make his way to the ring where he will put the title on the line against a very savagery, a very uh, determined, a very well-known edge. These two men have each other very well scouted at this point. I just constantly say like the same shit over and over again, but man, if it ain't hyping you up, because I'm getting hyped for this. I'm really excited that we're going to do that. We're going to just let them battle it out. We're not going to pick one or the other. We're just going to let them go for it. And there it is, the World Heavyweight Championship. The, the title that these two men have been fighting over for months. Guys, months. Wow. This amazing crowd is in for one hell of a match. And one of them is going to walk away here tonight and be able to be called champion. We're just going to start the match, let the computer do all the work. And here we go. They're going to lock it up. Booker T looking to take control there. He's got him in a bit of an arm bar, a bit of a, a an arm wrench, and he's gonna he's gonna drop uh, Edge down by the knee. He's got the arm though. He looks like he's working the arm early here. Edge though breaking out of it, and it, he grabs the left arm immediately. The left arm is in pain now. Edge takes control. He's got he's got him from the back. Could he hit a suplex here? Some sort of German? No. Snapmare by Booker T, and now he's got him in a sleeper hold, a bit of a chin lock. Though Edge now, left arm of Booker T, drops him down. There we go. So far, back and forth between these two men, and even uh, an even trade of events. There you go, right hand by Edge. Now they lock up again. The third time these two men have locked up here tonight. And there you go, Edge now working the, the asshole of the referee. There it is. He spreads the legs. There we go. And now Booker T, though, dropping Edge down. Ma move for move there. Oh, big elbow by Edge. Booker T, though, goes right into it. Edge, reversal, drops him down. Edge looks like he's he's taking control of the match. Nope, right hand, right hand. And now, there we go. A big chop by Booker. Dropping him down. Sidewalk slam. So far, so good. Both men looking good. Both men bringing their best here tonight. Huge clubbing blow by Booker T. Booker T still in control. Here we go. Another sidewalk slam. Drops him down. Going to really work the back area of Edge here, uh, as you can tell. Although, a uh, huge elbow there. Goes for the right hand. Booker T reverses. Now he's going to in a fireman, uh, fireman carry. Drops him down into a Samoan drop. Rolls him over. What's he going for here? Working the the right arm this time. Nope. Drops him down. He was just dragging him. Working the back though. Really working the back. There you go. Another boot. There's a a boot to the back of the knee. Back of the left knee. I just keep on repeating myself. I don't know what happened there, but. Something by Booker. Huge spinning heel kick. Edge is down. Edge is out. Booker T in full control. Booker T looking to regain his championship here. Throwing him off the ropes now. Booker T. Oh! Big flapjack there by Booker. Big flapjack there. Booker T in complete control here. Looking to finish off Edge early if he can. Edge now tossing Booker T out of the ring. Maybe going for a breather. No, he goes right out after Booker. Looks like perhaps maybe a different side of Edge here. If you remember, Booker T was attacking Edge uh, towards the end of the, the last couple of weeks there. And now maybe Edge sending him to the outside so that way he can get quite a bit of an advantage. Use the outside to his uh, to his advantage. Using the barricade there. Smashing the head off of the barricade. That's got to hurt even though there is padding there. It's a very thin layer of padding. Steel underneath. And now Edge in full control outside the ring. He cannot win the title out there, but if he can bring Booker T down, he can wear Booker T out and he can throw him back into the ring, Edge can win the title. He's not going to want to count out victory here. He's just going to go back into the ring, reset the count there. That's what he was doing. And now it's right back to the outside. Right back to the outside. Right back to the attack on Booker T. He's going to throw him right back into the barricade. Huge right hands there in the corner of the barricade. Booker T goes down. For the first time in this match, Edge is in complete control, and he is looking very good, although me saying that, a corkscrew there. Uh, 
by Booker T. And now Booker T going in to reset the count, perhaps. If he goes back out, he will uh, have reset of the count. But Edge now getting back into the ring before the 10 count. And we're back at it, though. Edge, oh, big drop there onto Booker T. Maybe Booker T not bringing Edge into the ring really really screwed him over there because edge came right back in and right back on top of it one two and a kick out by booker t the first pinfall attempt by either man booker t now in the legs of edge although he's gonna slip right out he's gonna want to get into something here get into something there you go big right hand or i guess it was really a forearm edge though taking control back chin lock here by edge booker t is gonna want to get out of this Perhaps some elbows to the midsection. Maybe he's going to want to try and rake the eyes or something here. Booker T looking to struggle, though. Looking for... He's struggling to get out of this. Edge could win here with a chin lock. Nope. Booker T now getting out of it. You're going to want to hit the elbows, Book. There you go. There you go. Edge now. Favoring the midsection. There's a snapmare by Booker. No. And now Booker into the chin lock. All right. Move for move, these two. Is Edge going to struggle as much as Booker did, though? And it looks like it looks like maybe he is going to struggle. No, it looks like he's getting out a little bit quicker than Booker. Maybe maybe Booker is a little bit worn out, a little bit more worn out. Maybe that attack on the outside uh, by Edge really did Booker T in. That might be the deciding factor in this match. Dropping Booker down on the knee. A bit of a gut buster there. I just call everything that's, that's dropped down on a knee a gut buster, but that's okay. Edge... Oh, Booker T with a reversal, and now the the back to the, the left arm there. Working the left arm in the back, Booker T, is Edge seems to be just kind of working maybe the head area, going for maybe a full body uh, assault here. Neck breaker, though, there by Booker T, and we know, all know how, uh, you, you know, how bad Edge's neck is. Huge spine buster there by Booker. Is Booker looking to go for the victory? Here it is, a pitfall, one. Two, and... No, Edge kicks out. Edge kicks out. I'm getting light at it. I'm going way too fast here. Big right hand there by Edge. Booker T going for a grab, though. Misses it. Edge drops him down, going for a pinfall himself here. I can't see the ref, so I don't know what the count is at. I'm Edge, it looks like Booker T kicked out, so maybe a two count there. Stopping the back of the head of Booker T. Edge, vic vicious. I almost said victorious. Edge, furious. Edge, vicious. A vicious, vicious side of Edge. Big spinning heel kick there by Booker T. Booker T wiping the blood, perhaps, off of his face? Maybe some sweat, though. Could probably be sweat, because Booker T... Oh! Oh! Edge? Edge going for... Edge setting him up. Edge is setting him up for the spear. This could be it. We could have a new world champion. Oh, he hits it. He hits it. Here we go. One. Two. Oh, and Booker T kicks out. Booker T kicks out. Edge not victorious there. He did hit the spear, though. Booker T is looking down and out. If Edge can hit just a few more maneuvers, perhaps another spear, he will have the World Heavyweight Championship around his waist. And Booker T looks to have been busted open by Edge. These two men giving it their all. Edge now springboard elbow from the outside to the inside of the ring. Running off the ropes here. Oh, he goes for a kick. Booker T evades it. Huge right hand. No. Belly to belly. Toss suplex by Edge. Hit the pin, Edge. A little late here. No, oh, he's not going for the pin. He drops an elbow. Drops an elbow. Drops a leg drop across the throat of Edge. Or Booker T. He's got him in the chin lock. Back in the chin lock. Booker T struggled to get out of this last time. Could this be it for Booker T? Is Booker T going to lose the World Heavyweight Championship here in a chin lock? No. Booker T getting out of it. Elbows to the midsection. Edge favoring the midsection again. Booker T now in control. Booker T is going to need to get a lot of control here. He's going to want to go for uh, the scissor kick and perhaps a quick victory here. He's going to want to maybe, maybe hit a roll up or something. Try and catch Edge off guard if he can. Because it's been all Edge so far. And there it is. A big knee to the side of the face by Edge. He's going to go for a suplex here. Drops him on the back of his head. Booker T is looking rough. Booker T is looking in a bad way. Edge setting up for something here. What is he going for? Another spear. 
A second spear. The second spear in that city is going to drag Booker T, to the, Booker T to the center of the ring. And he's going to go for the pin. We've going to have a new World Heavyweight Champion. One, two, and three. No! Booker T kicks out. Booker T kicks out. Booker T not going out like that. <coughs> Losing my voice here. Edge going for something there. Booker T reverses. Booker T throwing Edge into the corner. Booker T has a real opportunity to win this match here. Throwing Edge to the top rope. He's going to have to pull out all the stops now if he wants to win this match. With two spears in the book by Edge. Two kickouts by Booker. They're going to go for a big back body drop. Never mind, that's not the name of that move. I do apologize. Edge though, back up. Edge knocking Booker down. Huge clothesline. Clothesline. Drops him down. Go for the pin. Go for the pin, Edge. This is it. This is it. No. It's it. DDT. I'm not education. Is that what that's called? He's going to go for the pin here. We're going to have a new world champion. One, two, three. And Edge is victorious. Edge regains his world heavyweight championship. These two men are not done at it yet. They're going to go to SummerSlam. By God. By God. The title changes hands again. Edge victorious. Edge, the new world heavyweight champion. He put it all out there here tonight. Booker T came out early. Taking control of the match. But Edge took him to the outside. Beat him down. And was in control ever since. And Edge is going to get the world heavyweight championship. There it is. Edge looks surprised. Although he shouldn't be. He did just win. And there you have it, your new World Heavyweight Champion, Edge. Look at how excited he is to have that title back in his possession. I'm telling you right now, though, there will, there will be a rematch between these two men. Edge has won his World Heavyweight Championship, Booker T will be sure to put the new champion to the test with a title rematch soon. As I said, these two men are not done. They will go till SummerSlam where the rematch will take place. By God. What a match. What a night here at Battleground, guys. And we've only got one more match left. The WWE World Heavyweight Championship is on the line in the next episode of Universe Mode, guys. Seth Rollins, the former champion... Daniel Bryant, the current champion, Shawn Michaels, Chris Jericho. These four men are going to go at it in a no disqualification, fatal four-way match for the title. To be called champion, to be called the man, the top contender here in the WWE. Which man walks out victorious? You're going to have to watch the next episode to find out, guys. Thank you all for watching. This has been your boy, Intel. Bye.